Spaniel go out to Cochino to Canary Island. The Canary Island is a, is a good place to Japan and the Cochino. Ah, so when this when Spain lost um, Mexico for a while, they they did the Cochino in the Canary Islands because that's also a good place to um, grow the nopal and the cochineal there. Yes. Uh, and Canary Canary Island produce the fifteen years uh, two thousand tons of cochineal. So in fifteen years, keep Ah, in fifty. So in fifty years, they in the Canary Islands they produce what? Two thousand. Two thousand pounds of cochineal in fifty years. <laughs> and uh, maybe. When the, when the, the synthetic colors is beginning. Uh, when the synthetic production of coloring began. In Canary Island, all the production of cochineal is lost. Yeah, and now in the Canary Islands, all that production is lost because of the but synthetic maybe, dyes now that they use. Maybe the, co the combined company rescued some of the people to cultivate the cochineal. So that, that company, Campania, Campani. Campani company um, got people to start producing cochineal again for their, for their product. And, uh, <coughs> and uh, in Masa Lolo, you know, is it 1930? 1930, mm -hmm. uh, Peru began to cultivate cochineal. Uh -huh, Peru began to cultivate so, it, okay. In, in this time, Peru is the most important production oh, wow. so. Okay, so we said that now Peru is the biggest producer of the cochineal, not Mexico. It's a uh, pounds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one thousand five hundred pounds. So yeah, no, I need to know. In this type of Milky and tons. Toneladas. 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 Yeah. Okay. Toneladas. Sí. In un año. No. Bueno, no sé si... No, sí, en un año. En un año. Sí. You said that in one year that they, in Peru, they can produce 1,500 tons. Sí. Of what you know. And... And the... ¿Cómo se llama? It's the most important. The difference... Mm -hmm. in, for example, Peru in Mexico is because in Mexico I did the cultivation of cochino, but in Peru it only collects cochino because oh, okay. in, in this place in Peru the cochino is um, is uh, well, it exists only one species. In Peru, in Peru. It's a fine cochino. Okay. In Peru, it does not rain. <laughs> it doesn't rain, okay. It's poquito. Uh-huh. And they don't have a fur. Oh, they don't have the animals that eat the cochino. Okay. He said that here in Mexico. The conditions yeah. is, is the best. But here in Mexico, he has they to cultivate it. He has to grow it to keep it going here at his cochineal farm. But in Peru, they just collect it because it's naturally in the wild, because there's not as much rain and there's not um, animals that eat it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm -hmm.